22 verse uh, 46. Luke 23 40, 46. Okay, go ahead. If the spirit of uh, one can be placed into the hands of another, uh -huh. then they must be two uh, spirit, separate. Uh, separate beings. Okay. In all of these instances, Jesus is uh, clear, uh, support, uh, subordinate, subordinate to the Father. To the Father, good. You see, Jesus says it's not God. Read any page that you see Jesus talk. I'm not talking. Any page you see Jesus say something. Just read. Anywhere you see, anywhere, any quotation, read. Any page, read. Just go ahead, read. I want to, I want to show you something so I can give all this book. Okay, read here, read here, read here. Luke 2, 53, 52. Read hard. Go ahead. Baba Luke 2, uh -huh. 53. Uh -huh. And in Hebrew, uh -huh. we read that Jesus learned obedience. Uh -huh. <coughs> God, God thought he was a son, yet he learned obedience okay. by the things which he suffered. Okay, good. Jesus said that, right? So any page that you can open from here, can you read from here for me? Can anyone read from here? Act 5, 29 to 30. Act, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. We must obey God rather than we, we must what? We must obey God. The God of our fathers. The God of our fathers. Praise Jesus. Uh -huh. That he was God's servant. Jesus is a what? God. That is the Bible say that. So that means Jesus says he's no God. So anyone who says Jesus is God, on the day of judgment, Jesus will ask you, hey, I'm not God. <laughs> Some people say, Jesus say, I and, I and I the want, Father I are one. one. So if Jesus says, I and Father are one, that doesn't mean that Jesus says he's God. Now the Muslims, they cannot call Azan. They cannot, anywhere that you see in the Quran, go anywhere, Allah said, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Ashhadu Allah ilaha illallah. The next you may see. Ashhadu anna Muhammad Rasulullah. Whenever you mention the name of God, the next you will see the name of Prophet Muhammad. But that doesn't mean that Prophet Muhammad is God. So when you go to the Quran, Quran, Quran says, Obey Allah, Allah. God says, Obey me and obey the messenger. So obey me and obey all the messengers. You see, all the messengers of God, the Muslim believe them. All the messengers, we believe in all the messengers. We believe in them. And so on the day of judgment, when we go to heaven, you see, Jesus is going, we the Muslim will follow him. Moses is going, we follow him. Abraham will go, we follow him. Uh, Prophet Muhammad is going, we follow him. Those who say we don't believe in Prophet Muhammad, on that day, if Jesus said, no, I'm not, where are you going? <laughs> so, I'm not trying to, I am not here to try to change your mind for you to become Muslims, no. I want to give you all these books for free. Go and read about Islam. That is the only thing. So, number one, you take 99 reasons why Jesus is not God. All the quotation in the Bible is there. Take one. Take one. Uh, you got one, right? Uh, you got one here. You got one. 99 reasons. Okay, the next thing that we are going to share with you is Islam and Christianity. Islam and Christianity. What is the difference? Take one. Islam and Christianity here. You go. When you read, you understand. So Islam and Christianity. Islam and Christianity. You have one? Islam and Christianity. Islam and Christ. Another one I'm going to share with you is uh, Islam and science. Islam and science. Yeah. Islam and science. Islam and science. Islam and science. Take Islam and science. Islam and science. Islam and science. Who, get, who didn't get? Okay, I have to give you. Yes. 99 reasons why Jesus is not God. 
Here, this is one. One more. Okay, now, now, just go and read. When you